so the next video that I'll be watching will be keeping up with Star Rail Ho Ho. The only way to conquer fear is run. This is very likely a um, a tutorial video or a gameplay showcase of how uh, Ho Ho's gameplay is. This should be a good one. So let's not waste any time and jump right into it. In the most mysterious organization on the Zien Zhou, the Ten Lords Commission, there was an ill-fated young judge. She was originally a young, carefree girl, mm -hmm. but after she was possessed by Heliobus, she had to live with that monster from then on. However, it was a blessing in disguise for this foxing girl who was possessed at a young age, mm -hmm. as she unexpectedly became a judge of the Ten Lords Commission. Ooh, and one little blunder, and you're legendary for all the wrong reasons. Now, the once timid girl and the Heliobus, who was once sealed in her tail, have become perfect partners, purging evil spirits for the Ten Lords Commission. So, let's get to know this kind hearted and introverted little girl who survived tragedy and staged a comeback in the face of adversity. Hwa Joining us today is someone who played a pivotal role in shaping Hwa Hwa's journey, Mr. Tail! Oh, what are you afraid, afraid of? Well, there's something about sharing the stage with non-human beings. Well, this is interesting. It's not the first time. Be professional. Worry not. Hua Hua is a wind-type character following the path of abundance. Mm -hmm. Because of Mr. Tail, she has attracted much attention ever since she was a child, especially at night. Are you calling me a lantern? I wouldn't dare. Hua Hua's basic attack deals wind damage based on her max HP to a target enemy. Hey, mm -hmm. Mr. Tail, why does Hua Hua look a little scared? As long as I'm around, shouldn't fear be assumed? Of course! You are most fearsome. Extraordinarily so! Okay. <clears throat> Looking at Hua Hua's skill, you can understand why she was entrusted with important tasks at such a young age. Look how Hua Hua marches up the courage to wave her banner, displaying one debuff on the target ally and restoring a percentage of HP to the target and oh, the spell to the target debuff. based on a percentage of Hua Hua's max HP. After using her she dispels debuff as well? Oh my gosh. I, number of turns. I thought she only allies heals. She also dispels debuff of all allies as well? HP oh my gosh. What was max HP. After triggering Divine Provision, mm -hmm. if there are allies in current HP, it's less than or equal to half their own max HP. Okay. It will also trigger Divine Provision. Divine Provision effect cannot be triggered successively. Okay. Please note that every time Divine Provision is triggered, one debuff on the target character will be dispelled. And within ah. a set number of uses, what was skill count will be reset. Okay. Wow, you really can't tell by her appearance. This child seems timid, but when she gets down to business, she's absolutely decisive. Hmm. She can handle these little things by herself. <laughs> That's for sure. I wonder who's the voice for Mr. Tail, though. seems Tildo. to have encountered a difficult situation. It's your time to shine! Hua Hua casts her ultimate and summons Mr. Tail! Woo! Mr. Tail's entrance instantly invigorates the whole arena! Based on the max energy of each ally, Hua Hua regenerates a certain amount of energy for everyone except herself. At the same oh. time, she also increases the attack of all allies for a number of turns. Okay. Easy peasy, this is nothing! As a judge of the Ten Lords Commission, poor Hua Hua often has to face fierce villains. Fortunately, Hua Hua can use her technique, Fiend Impeachment of Evil, to get Mr. Tail's help to terrorize enemies, sending them into a horror-struck state, yeah. causing them to run away for a period of time. The terrorized enemy's attack might also be reduced after entering battle, which lasts for a number of turns. Mm -hmm. Serves her right for being a cursed one and attracting scary monsters. I'm really afraid it was gonna happen. Sure enough, several evildoers have turned up with bad intentions, no less. Mr. Tail, it seems there's no way to escape this time. Just a minor inconvenience. Okay. That shapeshifter struck hard and fast with a shower of punishing bolts, followed by a thudding calamity causing our allies to suffer heavy damage and a oh, yeah. The situation on the battlefield is severe. Can Hua Hua and Mr. Tail turn the tide? Although Hua Hua couldn't hide her fear, she still bravely stepped up to the plate. She immediately waves her banner and uses her skill to restore the HP of the seriously injured Trailblazer and adjacent allies, saving the team from the. Oh, Adjacent! I thought it's all. Thanks to the healing like provided Jason. by Hua Hua's divine provision, her allies launch continued attacks and regain their HP again during their actions. Beautiful! 
Ooh, our allies' energy is still a little shy being full. This is a good opportunity for Huahua to lead the team for a counterattack. Huahua makes a prompt decision and uses her He's ultimate summoning Mr. Tail. <laughs> now watch how I deal with him. Oh, Mr. Tail no, regenerates so energy from all allies and increases their attack. Before the enemy can fight back, they're overwhelmed by a continuous flurry of ultimates. Good. Crush them! So Huahua's ultimate regenerates all allies' uh, energy. No Holy crap! That is so. That's a wrap. <sighs> if the little girl hadn't been here, I would have burned them to ashes. <laughs> of course, <laughs> Mr. Tail is capable of taking on an entire army by wow. himself. If it wasn't for Huahua dragging him down. Hey, punk! Who gave you the right to speak about Huahua? Uh, Mr. Tail, you must understand. I mean, what judge? What well, was extremely talented and kind-hearted, and I'll she was the best person at time. Oh, are you saying that I am not important? No, 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 no. What, what is timid, but is also strong. But when it comes to who is the strongest, we will have to turn to Mr. Tail, of course. <laughs> huh. You seem to be getting the hang of this already. Poor Albert. This video really helps because at first I before watching this video, I thought that Ho Ho is just basically a, a another typical healer. But no, she's not she's not only just a healer. Because after watching this video watching this video, turns out not only she also heals um ally members, she also dispelled the debuff on them as well. And that's a cool thing. Like, and it's not just a single target ally is single target along with adjacent allies as well. That is way just by having that skill, Poho is a way better abundance character than um, Natasha and Bailu. Because Natasha she can only perform those on a single target. As for Bailu she heals um she has a um, better healing um healing bonus but once she targets one character the healing will go to another a random uh character which i didn't really like to be very honest so this video proves that fogo is a uh, is probably the best uh, abun abundance character. Oh, and also, right, uh, prior to watching to this video, I was wondering what her ultimate does, but turns out, right, it's just base. She um her out is basically it regenerates energy for all allies except for herself. Like, holy moly, that is so. That is so useful when it comes to, to combat. Especially such a nice enduring um simulated universe and the memory of chaos which is which is basically the um Honkai Star Rail's um spiral abyss. And now I kinda wish I got my hands on um Ho Ho though, but as I mentioned in my as I mentioned in the earlier when I while I was reacting to the uh, to Ho Ho's character trailer. I already used up all my resources on uh, on Topaz's banner. So yeah, it's kind of unfortunate that I won't be able to pull for Ho Ho. But I'm pretty sure not just Ho Ho, but every other limited characters will be getting a a rerun sometime later in the future. Even though I'm just a free to free player, so yeah. For those of you guys who, who want to get your hands on uh, Ho Ho, Good luck. Hope you guys uh, managed to pull for her. And uh, I think that's pretty much my reaction to this um, Keeping up with Star Rail, Ho Ho, the only way to conquer fear is run.